Namaste, welcome my sunshine's magical songs. How are you doing? Happy New Year, I love you. This again is a timeless reading, like, like all of the reasons that I make. If it's the first time that you find me, I am a psychic, a medium, a healer. I am Anna, I am Anna Robertson, and just whisper in this channel. You can find me Crece to Alma in Spanish. You have everything down below in the description. I have different services. I'm not doing private readings right now. But I'm doing different type of services that I'm sure that you would love to try. Personalized symbols to protect yourself or to manifest whatever you want to manifest with a video that I have prepared for all of you guys that you purchase the symbol to charge it as many times as you want. I am going to start a new service about past lives. I'm going to tell you a past life or several, the year, if you are a man or a woman, your name, not such a surname, your name, what were you doing in that past life? I think, and I'm not going to ask a lot of money, okay, as well as the symbol. I love you. Let's see what's blocking you in order to manifest love. I want you to be happy. <laughs> and I think this is very interesting to know what's blocking us in order for us to work on it and manifest incredible, shaky, sensual, sexy, fun, stable, abundant, and healthy love. My angels, you have to choose between one of these five groups that you can see right now. Let's be open to bring great energy to this channel because bringing great energy, not only in this channel, but with all of the YouTubers that you follow, all of the videos, when we give good energy, we give a like. And if you don't want to give a like, leave in a positive comment. We manifest. Complaining does not help to manifest, but being grateful and vibrating from our love chakra helps us manifest and help us help others manifest as well i love you thank you for your donations don't forget to subscribe if you want to support my channel give it a like leave it a comment i love you let's get started uno dos tres welcome group number one let's see which card came out for all of you guys so releasing alle allegiances i am saying correctly allegiances wow so what's holding you back to manifest love, to find that true and beautiful and magical love that you deserve, group number one? Remember, if you don't feel you resonate with these messages, choose another group. But what I see very clearly, when this came out, the first group, when you were very little, you didn't feel loved or you didn't feel supported or you didn't feel protected by your parents. I don't know if it's from both of them because it's many of you but at least one of your parents didn't give you that support or that emotional background that base that you needed in order to develop healthy relationships that's the reason why you always tended you always tend to be a little bit depressed or maybe you had several depressions or maybe you tend to have a low vibration or you tend to feel abandonment issues or you tend to feel that you're not worth it everything is coming from your childhood so if it's not both of your parents, it's your mom or your dad or that person that raised you. This is telling me very clearly, group number one, in order for you to manifest love, you need to heal your inner child. Go to therapy. I would recommend it. Going to therapy is going to transform your life. Not only that you're going to find love, no, you're going to have more money. You're going to feel happier with higher vibration. I sense that it's difficult for all of you to have your vibration high. Whether you have many energetical vampires around you or whether you tend to be depressed and you think it's the way you vibrate. No, it doesn't mean that you are like that. Maybe you got that from genetics, from your mom. Maybe your mom had a lot of depressions and you got that from, but really, we can transform everything. Go to therapy or do inner child guided meditations that you can find so many here on YouTube for free that you will be able to transform your life like magic in a few months, really, just in a few months. If you start, if you start cooperating with yourself, I am listening from spirits is that you have to give yourself 
some time to relax and to assimilate stuff that has happened in your life. Go to therapy. I would highly recommend if you don't want to go to therapy, regressive therapy. Regressive therapy is going to go directly to your unconscious mind. If you think it's difficult for you to remember stuff from your childhood, because sometimes it happens when we have a lot of trauma, it's very difficult for us to remember details. And we think nothing has happened. Oh, that does have not, that scene or that episode or those episodes have not affected me at all. I mean, I have just forgotten them. No, it's there. It's there. If you're still struggling with love and you're feeling like this, you have to heal that, okay, my love? Let's see. With the tarot based in writer, I'm going to prepare this week at last. <laughs> I'm going to prepare the course. <laughs> King of Swords, Air Element, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, and Five of Pentacles. Look at that. So you are vibrating in this card. Okay, I'm going to explain this card, the Five of Pentacles. Very curious because it came out in group number one of my Spanish tarot that I have just recorded with the same theme. I am doing the same uh, theme. I am channeling for both and shuffling in front of you guys as always. Wow. So again, I tell you, you, these are two characters, homeless, that are, are very cold outside. They feel left alone. They feel abandonment. They feel abandoned. They feel that they are struggling with ice, with snow. They are cold. They are it's like th these two characters are feeling that they, they don't have anyone on that there's no there's no there's no solution I, I I'm I'm suffering a lot sorry guys it cut it suddenly because of the battery these two characters are walking in front of a church a church where they can feel warm and they can get help but they don't see it so right now you need to get out of that vibration of that stuff that happened in your childhood you need to overcome it my love to come to this to come into your empowerment because you are somebody very strong but it's like your energy that low vibration is is getting too much into you it's not allowing you to find love how can you find love if you're not even feeling good with yourself it's impossible it's impossible so and you start telling you be careful with thoughts swords are thoughts are you overthinking too much are you overthinking of the past are you thinking too much in a negative way stop it get allow those thoughts to come out write a journal write a diary work with a therapist they're gonna tell you if you work with a therapist a few months your life will be transformed like a magic but if you don't do it life will continue like this I'm sorry, I'm, I don't want to put any drama on your life, but it's like that. I have done my work and now I'm, I'm, I'm watching results in my life. But if I didn't go to therapy, I wouldn't be here right now. And if I didn't do another healing uh, stuff, I wouldn't be here. So look, it makes sense. The three of swords. This is, this is like heartbroken. You feel like heartbroken totally. You need to heal and you need to heal your emotions, my love. Group number one, you need to heal your emotions. You need to go to therapy. I mean, I wouldn't hope you don't get angry or mad. Some people don't, are not prepared to this for these messages. I don't know why. And they keep vibrating in a negative way and they keep complaining. And I'm telling you guys that all of you guys from group number one, you are going to complain and you're not going to accept the reality. But you need to go to therapy. I see it very clearly. New day, inner journey. So you need to start a new day. You need to start new habits. You need to, to work your inner self. You need to work yourself and go to a professional one. Go to, maybe you should go to a healer and a therapist. Maybe regressive therapy if you feel that you need something more deep. But do something different. If you don't change anything, nothing will change. And you will continue like this. And I think it's a waste of time. Do you think suffering, suffering, suffering in this energy? Get out of here. This is just an illusion right now. But it's in your head so much, stuck in your head and in your heart. You don't let go. I think that it's difficult for you to let go of stuff that has hurt you. Forgive. Oponopono would do amazing for you to forgive. For okay, my love, yourself and others. Because you can do it. Get out of this vibration. Work yourself. Come on, my love. You can do it. Come on, group number one. 
fulfillment, pleasure. So you are attracting a couple, a partner that it's going to fulfill all of your desires, okay? Pleasure, you're going to have a lot of fun, a lot of joy, an incredible sexual connection, okay? But in order for you to get to here, which is your destiny, your fate, you need to go to therapy, you need to work yourself. Okay, my angel, but incredible of stories on your way. Incredible. I'm going to shuffle the unicorn oracle. This is the last message. Goddess, honor your divine feminine energy. See your inner beauty. Love every part of you. So love yourself. Do this for just a few months. One year. Oh, and oh my gosh, the love that it's coming on your way. Okay, but if you do this, let's ask spirit. And this is the last card. If they do the inner work, what's coming on the way? Great, three of wands. This is like a new horizon. This is like new perspective. You're going to see yourself different. You're going to see life different. You're going to perceive life different. You're going to see, oh my gosh, all of the possibilities that have always been there, but I couldn't see it because I was suffering so much. So you are going to get there. This is celebration this is success and this is a good base that you are creating but you need to start right now come on angel i love you keep going you can do it come on i have passed through the same all of us have passed through the same you can do it i love you Mwah. kisses subscribe if you feel your resonance with my energy i lo would love to see you on instagram thank you giving a like leaving a comment come on i'm with you i love you love you love you <laughs> Hi, my sweeties. Bye. Welcome, group number two. Let's see what's blocking you to find love. Come on. I sense, group number two, that you're very connected with animals. That playing with animals, whether you have animals at home, pets at home or not, the spirits are telling me this. You know, guys, that I'm a medium <laughs> and a healer. But if you start playing with animals, or maybe you should go to an organization that you can take care of donkeys or cats that have been abandoned or dogs do something with animals that's going to allow you to find love maybe some of you are going to find love over there <laughs> okay okay my angels relax the hold of darkness and be at cause i think that the angels are telling me okay i see this very clearly group number two the reason why you're not manifesting love is difficult for you is because sometimes you feel pity for some people that are very toxic for you. They bring you, they bring, they, it's like they, they bring you into darkness while you are somebody with a very high vibration. You're somebody with a very loving energy. You're somebody that you love to help everyone. You are always, always there for everyone. You're always even there for people that are not treating you okay. So spirits are telling you, stop vibrating and working with darkness and what is darkness means for you and maybe you have clients that are very toxic with you and you shouldn't be working with them in my case i have refused working with clients and they paid me a lot they were going to pay me a lot but if it's somebody very toxic i refuse it because that money it's like dark energy that's absolutely so stop doing stuff for people that envy you you're very intelligent you know those ones that envy you stop it <laughs> sorry if i talk to you like this <laughs> because i'm listening that from spirits and stop doing favors and stop doing stuff for people that that not deserve you it's good that you are in high vibration and you are like oh yes you have a lot of potential and you can help a lot of people and maybe you're in front of the camera like i'm doing and you're a healer or you you are a tarotist as well but stop doing so much for some people that they only bring you darkness they only bring you darkness uh, uh, toxic energy sorry i'm repeating twice so uh, you're very intelligent spirits are keep telling me group number two are very intelligent but they are sharing the energy too much to people that they shouldn't do that so be more selective and don't feel guilty don't feel pity Everyone is responsible for their own stuff. I remember it was the same in the past. I felt pity for some people and at the end of people treated me really bad. <laughs> Understandable. Because they have everything in low vibration, they don't want to do their work. And you are somebody that you are doing your personal work. So spirits are telling you. Great that you are for there for your people, for your crew. I am listening to some of you, for your crew, for your subscribers, for your clients. But some people, it's a no. Some people, it's a no. 
it's in your family friends people that strangers some people it's a no and they tell me some people you have to say no i don't feel guilty you don't have to save the whole planet no <laughs> i think that some of you have the ability to heal animals you're a natural healer okay let's see with the I, I only think that's the only thing that it's blocking you to find love. That you're giving your energy to people that they are draining your energy. You are it's not that because you're very intelligent. You know those ones that are criticizing you, that are judging you, and they are talking to you about or they are trying to use you. But it's because you have such a big heart. It's like oh, it doesn't matter. Mm, be careful. Yes, it does matter because that's self-esteem as well. Don't you think? I mean that ha I have learned with spirits as well. Look, <laughs> ten of pentacles. Oh my gosh. All of you guys, you're going to become very rich or you're attracting a partner that is very rich, very abundant in general. Not only that they have money, they are somebody that they're full of joy, they have a big heart. I mean, everything that you are, I think that both of you guys, you have to, you are learning the same stuff that you have to learn to put, to set up healthy boundaries. And the moment, I think that you're almost there. You're very close, very, very close. If it's not three weeks, three I don't think it's three years. Maybe if you're very young, maybe it's three years. But I think in general for all of you guys, it's three months. It could be even 10 days or 10 weeks or 10 months for some of you. But for sure, this is success. Both of you, you're going to live very, very good economically. And this person is going to bring you luck with money. Maybe you're going to win the lottery. I don't know, some of you. Or the, the lottery or maybe through your work or you're going to be very successful. If you have your own channel as well. Okay, I'm going to get these three. Okay, in the past you were heartbroken, but I think this is already healed. If it's not healed, do a little, a little bit more of meditations of your heart chakra. And because I'm watching the red, maybe you should do root chakra guided meditations. So you went through a very dark moment in your life, but you overcome it. And I think that's why you, you try to help everyone, but not everyone are willing to change or to do their personal work or to receive that help so you have to be selective who to help in a wise way i am listening from spirits and i think this is coming from the past it's not a problem if some of you you're still angry with the next release it forgive again oh my gosh six of pentacles this is somebody that has money is balanced and gives a lot of donations helps a lot of groups has helps a lot of organizations this is somebody very wealthy Page of Swords. This is Air Element. Yes, my Sanchez, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. And this is somebody, I think that one of the two is younger than the other one. And this is something, this is a new person. This is a new idea. Maybe some of you, you're going to find love through success, through your business. Maybe you are an entrepreneur. But again, I tell you guys, I don't sense like a lot of problems. You just need to select more the people that you give you stop giving so much you need to receive as well give and receive balance like the person that you are attracting that has a lot of money or maybe you both of you guys you're going to create a lot of money i see that both of you have a great heart big heart great heart let's see these ones that it's based in writer as well but with a different illustration wow the empress this came out in my spanish startup wow this is new beginning this is a new project maybe both of you you're going to meet through a project or you're going to create a project that it's going to help planet earth I, really guys i don't sense you just need to be more selective with people that's the only thing that it's blocking you and i'm going to finish with the oracle of the unicorns i don't sense anything else because i think that you all of you guys you have done a lot of healing sorry guys i'm getting um, i am um, Losing battery, <laughs> friendship. I think that some of you, you're going to start as a friend. Maybe it could be one of your friends in the present moment, okay? Who knows? Red hair, red or br very blonde hair, or brunette, okay? And I don't know why turquoise. They're telling me that maybe you should work with a turquoise, turquoise, turquesa, adventure. I think that maybe some of you, you're going to meet on a trip or on a project or on a trip because of your job. Look, number two i love you <laughs> keep going <laughs> give me a like you know i'm not going to repeat it you know what to do <laughs> if you have like this my mind is fine welcome group number four let's see what's blocking you in order to manifest love i think this is let me know guys in the comments if you think that this is interesting but if we 
know what's blocking us we can work on it and then we can manifest incredible love story that you deserve so let's see the card that came out for all of you guys group number four bring it into form this is incredible because this card came out i believe in the spanish tarot that i created two days ago it's incredible wow I have to be sincere normally when I'm preparing these tarots I do it in the same day but that day I was preparing the Spanish tarot first then I did the symbols that I keep uh, preparing just in case you're interested in the symbol personal symbol that will channel from spirit which one is good for your protection or maybe to manifest or maybe to for love etc for abundance let me know in the comments i i sent a private link to a video for all of the clients to charge the symbols as many times as you wish so let's go into the reading this card came out in the other reading it's unbelievable and as i said normally when i'm creating a tarot i finish it the same day but for whatever reason I stopped yesterday I didn't work on this tarot and two days later I and it's not a coincidence I think group number four if this has happened it means as well that okay <laughs> okay <laughs> spirits are telling me that one of the reasons and not only about love I think it's in many many areas in your life okay remember if you don't resonate with this group choose another one or choose other groups but what I'm sensing very clearly from both the spirits are telling me, whispering <laughs> right now, is that you tend not to be constant in your life. Maybe you started to, to play the guitar or to take classes to, to, because you wanted to learn how to play the guitar and you didn't finish, um, you didn't finish the course. Maybe you started some sort of studies and you, fin you didn't finish it, you left it. Maybe you have the tendency, I, let me know in the comments if it makes sense. But what I'm listening from spirits is that many of you, you start, to, you, you start to walk, you start to try something and suddenly you, you get bored and you leave it or you don't have patience and you leave it. I think that group number four, you are a very impulsive soul coming from the stars. For sure, you're a star set, and normally star sets we are not we are not very patient. I had I had to learn because uh, through time when I was very young, I was not patient at all. I wanted things fast because they were very clear in my mind, and I didn't understand why I didn't have that fast, why I wasn't in that relationship fast. I mean, you know what I mean, guys. So maybe this is the reason. Whatever age you are, you need to start walking the path, and sometimes things. You need time for anything. And if you want to manifest love, are you giving yourself time in order to know yourself better? Are you giving yourself time to heal? Are you giving yourself time to rediscover yourself? To be constant. Constancy is the key for all of you guys. Group number four. If you're going to learn how to be patient, if when you're going to meet somebody, you're going to be patient to really know them good, not like, oh, Oh, he or she's not giving me what I want in one hour or in one day or in one month. Be patient. Walk the path. Bring it into form. You need to bring it into form. It's great that you know what you want, but sometimes I listen from spirits that they, they offer you really good people or good opportunities. Not only talking about love, but you don't, you're not patient. <laughs> I understand you. I work the same. So give it time bring it into form and to bring it into form you need to take one step and then the next one and then the next one be patient don't worry about the how and when about love again the time to repeat it don't worry about the how and when but just walk and focus in the present moment and try to be constant with yourself and then somebody will not that will come to your way will not abandon you will not betray you will not leave you will not play with you because if you're constant with yourself what are you saying to the universe when we are taking care of ourselves and it makes sense i wish i knew this when i was young <laughs> when we are being constant with ourselves we are taking care of ourselves we are expressing to the universe i am taking care of myself and i am constant i am not abandoning myself i am not starting something and in two days i lose interest no i am i am 
having more interest in myself, in my well-being, loving myself, knowing, understanding more myself, being patient with myself. And that way, you're going to attract an incredible man or woman that it's going to take care of you and it's going to put in, invest time in you. And it's, it's, it's going to... Yes, they, they really want to meet you, not somebody... Really, guys, and this is true. Whatever it you have, and maybe some of you is just a reminder. I'm not telling you guys that if you meet somebody very fast, it's not going to work out. No, I'm not telling you that. But it's true from my experience and from many of you that you are, maybe you're very young and you have a lot of experience or more than me, and you're younger than me. But if they ask me, for example, I'm not, this is not to talk about me, but from my experience, if right now I met somebody, maybe that I felt really attracted, a, a great chemistry, okay, sexually very attracted. But if that guy would mm, try to meet me very fast, everything to uh, he would rush everything, I would leave instantly. Maybe some of you, you are saying, ah, oh, that's r ridiculous. But be aware, if you're receiving these messages and it makes sense, do not go out with somebody that is rushing sex, that is rushing, is telling you he or she loves you in the first date. I'm not telling you that if both of you guys, your two influence or your soulmates, that you don't feel that. But patience, calm. That person that is going to, to, to get the effort, to take the effort to really know you. Okay? And remember, many people speak, but not a lot of people walk. <laughs> many people speak. I love you, I want to be with you, but not many people does take those steps that is really demonstrating you, showing you that they love you, showing you that they're fighting for this relationship. So be aware in the first moment, you're going to see people that rush everything. Think about it, be careful. I'm not telling you guys that maybe some of you, you're going to meet like that, but if this card has come out, it's because of something. Let me know if it makes sense. I think that it's going to make sense for many of you. My angels, I'm going to take the tarot based in writer, the original writer. I'm sorry that I haven't created yet the course of tarot. I'm going to start tomorrow, I promise. I'm selling it already in Spanish and I haven't done it in English. Sorry. 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 Okay, this want to come out, okay? Wow. <laughs> Wow, oh my gosh, the six of wands and the star Aquarius and we are, have started an Aquarius season. Oh my gosh, this is absolutely success. Again, I tell you, this is very important. If you feel it in your body, if you feel it in your soul, that these messages are for you and it makes sense, listen, this is very important. <laughs> oh, you're like, Anna, oh, no, you're missing me, keep going. Okay, if you have the courage to go step by step with yourself and when the one or, or maybe it's going to be more than one person that could be incredible for you several soulmates that are coming it could be even more than one and you and you have to choose okay so you have possibilities to you have possibilities don't worry this is celebration this is success and the star is absolutely success maybe even some of you you're going to be very successful or you're going to meet a celebrity okay it could be somebody that it's a celebrity but if you take the courage with yourself and you're patient with yourself and you are try to calm down, try not to be too impulsive. And when that person or maybe several arrives in your life and you're going to choose, okay, because you're, you're going to be able to choose, choose wisely. I am listening from spirits. Do it slowly. Don't rush. Don't take a decision on your first instinct co coming from sex, from your sexual chemistry. Okay, <laughs> I'm not telling you to choose the one that does not turn you on. No, but be aware that you're very, very impulsive, very sexual, very passionate. Step by step, if you have the courage, if you are patient with yourself, you are going to have an incredible love story that it's going to be complete success, success, success. No separation, no divorce. This is a lifetime couple coming from past lives. This is destiny. This is fate. 
for sure one of the two is Aquarius or has air element or it could be earth element as well sorry fire element as well maybe some of you it's earth element okay if I have said it okay it was a mistake but if I say it is because of something so success 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 walk your path slowly don't be so impulsive and don't if you want to if you feel you're the, if you're that person that you feel that you want to say i love you in the first uh, five minutes now maybe it's a little bit exaggerated but you know what i mean breathe <laughs> breathe he or she's not going to run away if he or she's meant for you because this is destiny this is fate he or she's not going to run away you don't need to tell them your whole life in the first date <laughs> you don't need to tell them everything in your the first day slowly spirits are showing me this i'm not telling you come on this is a general reading and if you want to be like that it's perfect but i think this is a mes message for many of you imagine yourself like that you are this incredible it's not that you the, the angels are comparing you with a gift but imagine that you are a beautiful gift okay and suddenly your future husband your future wife because I, i'm sensing that okay um don't worry guys because if you want to become a mom or dad you will be if you want you don't want to have kids it will be i mean whatever whatever you have in your mind okay <laughs> abundance is going to flow no 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 problem at all and health issues is going to get better okay health issues for some of you is going to get better i'm happy for that this is great news so let me admit that imagine yourself that you're this beautiful present this gift okay and your future husband of your future wife has this gift and they want to open it but it's not still it's still not the right time they cannot open it yet because it's not christmas yet imagine it's just a simile it's a it's a metaphor okay imagine that if each time this person received a gift and whenever they wanted the gift they open it but they didn't wait for it do you think the reaction would be different or the same if somebody's waiting for something that it's very special and magical and is waiting and waiting and waiting and is watching the gift and is watching the gift i'm not telling you to have sex or not on the first date or in three months or in one year i'm not talking about that i'm talking that you need to have patience allow that person to know you you don't have to say everything about you on the first date everything no no and i think that if you tended to do that it's because you're scared of losing that person i think for whatever reason your mind thinks your unconscious mind thinks that if you tell everything you 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 have to say everything about you no you're like this beautiful gift that the other person is going to love to open in a very slowly and to be patient to open it again i'm telling you sorry it's not a comparison that you are like a gift which you are from the universe you're loving a loving gift from the universe you're somebody magical and beautiful so slowly although you're going to have the tendency that you would want to rush things slowly if you want this success slowly know that person slowly allow that person to know you slowly and that and that way you're going to rediscover something different in you slowly walk the path slowly know that person slowly and you will have everything with this person you will have everything don't worry don't have fear okay group number four and let me shuffle to end up the reading one of the the oracle of the universe which i love prosperity what did i tell you guys prosperity you are going to have everything with this person this person is very abundant if they're not rich they have a lot of money i'm sorry i was <laughs> I have to control myself. They have a lot of money. The, uh, not only that they have a lot of money, they have a good health. They can, I mean, this is somebody, I think that this is somebody that was very impulsive in the past as well, ha made a lot of mistakes with people, with clients in his business, in her business. This is somebody very, um, like an old wise soul. This is somebody that, I sense that they're going to make you think about stuff that you were not aware and uh, they're going to make you think and that's i think that's good i think that you you're attracting somebody very intelligent because you need somebody very intelligent otherwise you get bored very easily <laughs> and this is somebody that it's going look what the unicorn is doing it's like i respect you 
I respect you. This person is going to respect you infinite. But in order to attract somebody like that, you have to respect yourself. And to respect yourself is to, to respect the rhythms, to respect the, the cycles that you need to pass through, the, to respect everything. You are a sacred, loving being from God, from the universe, from light. So this person, I like it because this person is pure. It's pure, very loving. And it's true that when they're working, they change a little bit, okay? You're going to sense that, that when they're working on their business, I think that they're, well, I, th I think that some of them, they have their own business and others, they're working for a company. Even some of them, they're working with a family. Even some of them could be f YouTubers. I am listening. Okay, my lovelies. And to end up the reading... Gateway, wow, this is beautiful. Wow, oh my gosh, it's incredible. Group number four. In this tarot, I cannot remember the name, I'm sorry, I'm sorry about this tarot, but wow, at the back, stillness. <gasps> and gateway, oh my gosh. Wow, you must be very beautiful, very attractive. You must be very beautiful. And you know it. I think that it's easy for you to. To get people to notice you maybe you have to be more mature in that sense you know that to to for something really good to uh, to arrive you need to appreciate more i'm not telling you guys that you don't appreciate but it's part of the path of the evolution but look as i was telling you guys in this deck only one unicorn appears i believe so if i can remember right so this person it's another another level another level so I, I am happy that this person is coming towards you and you need to to learn how to be to be stay still stillness stillness in the in the purity in the beauty you have to how can i describe this when you're going to be in front of this person just being quiet and and connecting you know guys the, the movie avatar when she says to him, I see you. Have you seen that movie? I see you. I see your soul. I see your inner beauty. I see your purity. I see your heart. That's the moment that you need to acquire. Before you were not ready. That's why you didn't manifest this incredible soulmate. You were not ready in the past, but right now you are. Just be patient with yourself. Know how to be calm. Know how to be alone as well. Enjoy yourself. Do stuff that makes you feel like in the present moment and not so impulsive and rushing everything. You know, guys, that we come from a... And that's why the virus has happened a, 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 as well. All of us, we were like machines, like duk, 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 moving like that. In Madrid, we were like crazy, like... <gasps> yes, and, and the virus has made us like... Oh, you are going to stay at home. You are going to stay alone. You are going to connect with yourself. You are going to release and heal. You know what I mean, guys? Incredible love stories coming on your way. I love you. Think about a question. This is my gift to you. Think about a question and, and spirits are going to answer. So one, two, three. Listen to your intuition. You know. You know that he or she is coming. I relax. Okay, my sweeties, my little witches. I think that all of you guys, you're a little bit witch. <laughs> I love you. Namaste. If you have liked it, a like, subscribe, and you know, guys, I, can, I would love to see you on Instagram. Thank you for the donations. Even one dollar goes for the channel and the material. I have just bought this microphone of road. <laughs> I hope you notice it in my voice. And I love you. Mwah! If you want a personalized symbol for just 11 and 11 euros, it's very cheap, I believe. Let me know in the comments. I am offering a new service about past lives. I will tell you what past life, one of your past lives, the year, your name, what you were you doing in that life. I think I'm asking, I have just published it in, the, in my Instagram Spanish, 15 and 55 euros. Okay, I'm going to put it in the description. I love you. Bye, my sweeties. Bye. Welcome group number four. So let's see 
What exactly is blocking all of you? What I was listening already from spirits is the song Oh Happy Days. So I don't know if some of you, you're natural singers or you love to sing, or it's been quite a long time since we haven't been singing or just being relaxed and having like a playful time. I really think group number four that what's going to allow you to manifest love is to sing, to have joy, to relax. It's as simple as that. I really think that, but nevertheless, I'm going to see the card that has come out for all of you guys. So group number four, it is Sacred Fool. Wow. It's incredible. <laughs> if we see this character supposed to have fun, to make people laugh, isn't it? This is like the card, the first card of the Tarot based on Rider. This is the, the Fool, which is New Beginning. This is somebody impulsive. This is somebody that has received the call, knows what they have to do. They don't listen to the rest of the people. So what I'm perceiving already, group number four, that in general, you're somebody, maybe your mom doesn't like somebody or your dad or your friends. If you like somebody, you don't care at all what others tells you about that person. And I don't think that's bad. I think that's good. I think that many of the people that surrounds you, they are very overprotected towards you. And I, I really don't understand why, because I see all of you guys, group number four, that you're very strong, you have a strong will, you have a lot of personality. You, I mean, all of us, we have fear, but I don't, I don't see you guys like you vibrate from fear. Okay, what could be stopping you as well to manifest love? If we see this character, Sacred Four, I think that, mm, let me know in the comments, but I think what's blocking you to manifest love is that sometimes you forget about yourself a little bit in that sense. It's, it's, really, it's true that concerning other comments or judgments, you don't care, but sometimes you overgive too much to others, or maybe you spend too much time with others. Are you having time by yourself? Are you having time alone? Do you have the tendency to make people laugh so they are comfortable when maybe you're having a bad day and what it could be best for you is to share with a good friend or friends that you're not having a, a good moment? I think that that's blocking you to manifest love because when we, I mean, I understand that type of, of way of being because I have been like that and sometimes and many, many people have been like that because maybe you don't like to complain. You like to see people that you're there, okay? You like to see people happy. But when we are a little bit a tendency of people pleaser, which in a way it's a, a little bit of people pleaser, we tend to close, close like, yes, to close a, spa a space where we need to talk and to express our feelings. I'm not having a good day. I feel frustrated because of this. I feel frustrated because I'm not manifesting love, whatever. So spirits are telling you, great that you, that you make people feel comfortable and having fun, but if you need to talk about your feelings, talk about your feelings. I am listening group number four from your spirits that a good way for you to manifest love would be doing the manifestation with a bottle of water. You know, guys, I'm going to make a video about this because I want to help you guys. I'm going to mix videos. Maybe some of you, you're going to leave the channel. I wish you the best. And others, you were going to love it. But I'm going to make a mix in the Spanish channel and the, the English one to help to healing, healing videos or to help you manifest. Okay, Because I think this is important. There are many tarotists, but not all of the tarotists explains how to manifest or, or is a healer. And this is my thing. So as I tell you guys, a great, a great way of the, the spirits are telling me to tell you that with water. Maybe I have a glass of water here, okay, with sea salt <laughs> to protect myself from spirits. But uh, you don't need sea salt. But maybe you prepare a bottle of water in the morning and you put your hands around the bottle of water. And maybe if you're wa still watching this video, you want to manifest great love, a true love, okay? So you put it like that. Even if you want to 
purchase a symbolized symbol that I prepare. I am preparing for love, to manifest, for health, to protect from demons, to protect during the night, etc., etc. Maybe if you if, if you're inter interested as well, you could paint the symbol that I send you, and you could charge the bottle. In, you put it in front of the video that I'm going to send you that I have done for all the clients. And if you don't want to purchase a symbol from me, it's fine. But charge the bottle of the water. Say aloud what you want. Write down exactly what type of person you want to manifest. And then you drink the bottle of water slowly during the whole day. You even can charge it with the full moon and the new moon. Okay, my angels? If you want a new person, new moon is better. Okay. <laughs> so, my lovelies, I'm going to shuffle the tarot based on writer. Oops, this one wants to come out. Wow, King of Pentacles. Oh my gosh. I think that many of you, you're very focused in manifest abundance, abundance and in your... That's good. Keep going. Or maybe you are not manifesting on that passion that it's going to bring you a lot of money and abundance and that's why you are not manifesting the one. Remember that everything is developing the way you chose before you were born. Before we are born, we choose everything. Everything. Maybe sometimes we get stuck in situations that are toxic and negative too long because we don't remember who we are, but that's not your case. So if it's not you, he or she is very wealthy or comes from a wealthy family. I don't think it's a celebrity. I think this is a person that comes from a wealthy family and is continuing with the abundance. I mean, I don't sense that money is going to be an issue. And maybe some of you, you're working on that. You're working because you really want to manifest great abundance and and you're working on your stuff and keep going okay this is a this is the the, the yes the the message from you guys they have to keep going whoops wow oh my gosh you have so good cards wow three of cups celebration joy really i think that many of you as I tell you, have fun, enjoy, relax, and if one day you're feeling low, say it, share it. And if you don't have anybody to share it because you don't feel those people, you feel that that safe space that I can allow myself to be vulnerable, write it down or talk with your spirits or pray. Because if you take care of yourself in those moments that you're feeling, whatever you're feeling, frustration, anger, very happy, not, if you share it with somebody or you write it down, you are going to get into this incredible, incredible soulmate. I am listening, not twin flame, soulmate. Incredible soulmate. This is celebration. I think that both of you guys are going to leave soon, very early. Sorry, guys, the battery. And I think that some of you, you're not from the same country, okay? Ace of Wands. Wow. Fire element. This person is coming very fast towards you things are going to move very fast between both of you i'm gonna tell you guys you just need to do manifestation like with the water writing down journaling and relaxing and if you need to talk about something that you feel don't be that don't be where is it don't be that fool that is trying to make everyone feel happy if you need to release any type of feelings release it and that way you're going to allow to this to come forward very fast because i think that from all of the groups your man or your woman your summits coming the fastest from all of the groups that i i sense by far okay my lovelies so let's see i'm going to shuffle this other tarot based on writer but with other illustrations oops i sense a lot of grandmothers here wow seven of cups I think that you're attracting in your life not only this incredible personal soulmate but you're attracting as well i think that from both of you guys meeting each other you're going to bring each other a lot of opportunities and possibilities and i'm gonna tell you this is somebody that has a lot of wealth and because they have a lot of wealth he or she knows how to use it in a in a positive way and they have a lot of sources they have a lot of influences they know a lot of people so they're going to help you in whatever you are trying to manifest now you're trying to manifest your own business. He or she is going to help you. You're trying to, to pay your debts. 
I, I think that they're going to pay it. And maybe some of you are going to feel uncomfortable, but allow, allow the universe to help you. And if it's not that way, allow the universe to help you to put you in front of you people that is going to be there for you. You don't have to be the, the saver. You don't have to save anyone. I keep listening from spirits. You don't have to be the hero of, all, of everyone. You don't have to save everyone. You don't have to be the therapist for everyone. You don't have to be the fool to make jokes. Um, it's not, I'm not, a, I'm not calling you a fool. I, I am talking about the character in Tarot. Okay. So really you don't have any problem. Just share. If you cannot say it with somebody, write down how you feel and here she's going to appear. Maybe some of you, it's going to be even a client. Okay. This person, it could be a client or you're going to be the cl their client could be. Because I see if it's on the Facebook group, a group, a course or something, something that you pay or I see because it's many of you. This is not a, this is not a private reading, but I think that some of you, you could be maybe you could be the client or the other way around. Okay. And my love is I'm going to shuffle. Yes, I'm going to shuffle these ones. These ones that I like. Wow, stillness came out in the previous group. This is amazing. Both of you, you are going to make a very beautiful couple together. I mean, physically, it's like people are going to tell you, oh my gosh, it's like you're perfect for each other. Physically, same humor, same hobbies, same taste on food, on music. It's incredible. Even if you could look like twin flames, but I think that this person is more a soulmate. This is pure love. This is true love. For me, this is the meaning of true love, pure love. And both of you, you're going to be able to be in those moments of silence that you're not going to be uncomfortable. No, you're going to even to love silences with this person. But sometimes you need to, to be by yourself and to write down how you feel. Okay. I keep listening from spirits. Wow. Navigate by the sun, honeybee. Maybe some of you you're going to meet in a coffee shop or the first date it's going to be in a coffee shop with a cake and a coffee or a tea or another drink. But this is somebody that it's, that it's going to bring you light and sun into your life. This is somebody very positive. I think that you are like that as well. And it's great that you are like the sun for everyone, but be the sun for yourself in order to attract this person. Come on, allow yourself, allow the universe to bring you this person is waiting for you. I think that this person has been waiting for you more than you to that, for that person, because some of you, you were distracted with other people or an ex. And right now, both of you, you're ready to find each other. I really feel it that it's the moment. It's the correct time. I want you to, before I end up the reading, I want you to think about a question. Let's see what spirits wants to tell us through this beautiful mini tarot. You're going in the right direction, not the right time. Okay. So I think that this message is for some of you. Some of you, I think that you are getting stubborn in somebody that you have in your mind is not that person for you, meant for you. And others, it's not that, but you're going in the right direction. So all of you guys, you have to turn from here to here. And I think that in the past, those people were not meant for you. And this person absolutely very meant for, and this person is very very attractive i'm listening very beautiful again they tell me i'm very intuitive okay my love is i love you group number four thank you for the donations thank <laughs> God for the channel <laughs> i love you i would love to see you on instagram have a beautiful day and if you're interested in any of my services you can read it in the description of the video my email i love you welcome group number five let's see which card came up for you let's see why you're not manifesting now why <laughs> heaven sent okay what do i sense with this beautiful card let me see let me see if this focuses what do i sense very clearly that that person that you have in your mind for, I think that for quite a long time that you are sensing that you're connecting through meditations through dreams that you're imagining physically the way they are the way they move everything now that group I think group number five you have absolutely imagined everything <laughs> you must be very good at manifesting 
So this is the meaning for me that heaven sent that that they are sending you exactly that person that you want to yes to manifest okay let me ask spirits okay spirits what's blocking group number five what's still blocking them okay they're telling me the spirits it's it's something concerning money are you struggling with money right now do you feel you're not worth it of having abundance I mean, they're telling me that the moment you solve the thing about money, he or she's going to come. I don't want you to think like, I don't understand. What does money have to do with love? It's not about money, but it's the energy that you're relating yourself with money. Because when we are good at manifesting love, uh, sorry, <laughs> money, is because we sense we are worth it and we are in touch with abundance. Abundance, it's in general abundance, health, love, life in general opportunities so what the spirits are telling me i have to say what they're telling me when you start to manifest money easily he or she will come suddenly because you're going to sense you're going to vibrate from i am worth it i deserve the best i deserve a great abundance in my life great health great friends great joy doesn't make sense queen of wands are you a little bit stubborn <laughs> fire element <laughs> are you a little bit stubborn <laughs> i think group number five that sometimes you're a little bit too hard on yourself and sometimes you don't you don't connect with people the way you can because you have been hurt a lot in the past maybe by family, maybe by an ex or several exes. I think that you have, you have reached to a point that you're a little bit cold in general emotionally. I'm not, I, I'm not, because this is a character seems a little bit cold, but I mean, well, in reality, it's very passionate, okay? But maybe people have the wrong impression with you. Could it be that you seem too serious? Or maybe because you are somebody that physically people have a can feel a lot of respect towards you. So relax, relax, chill out, make a joke with people that normally uh, there's a lot of serious energy. Practice in work, do something different with co-workers. Just uh, say a compliment to somebody. Start practicing the energy. How, because this place, it makes sense. They were telling me about this today as well. For example, I was in a supermarket today and there was this old man that was very close to the queue. I could tell that he he was thinking about a product, okay? And I could tell that he was first in the queue because I'm very psychic, <laughs> or maybe it was just logic or the mix. And he suddenly was going to make the queue. The queue was very long. And I told this old man, step in front of me because you were in the queue, right? And he said, oh, yes, yes, but it's okay. No, I said, no, no, go, come on. And he, he was feeling so grateful and I knew that I changed the, the rest of the day for him. I mean, if he was feeling low, sad or lonely or his energy was feeling low, I knew I raised the vibration just by that, that easy gesture. I just was nice with him. So, spirits are telling me to tell you, <laughs> maybe some of you, you are shy or maybe you don't see yourself doing that. But if you want to manifest your true love, start practicing with your co-workers or with you even you with your friends tell them that you love them i love you I, let me give you a hug i mean with the co-workers no but maybe with a co-worker wow you, you look beautiful with that color or just be nice i mean you know how to be nice does it make sense but the spirits are telling me practice with people make people make the day different with a nice gesture coming from you and that's going to allow you to connect with that energy and the universe is going to bring you that incredible and beautiful soul coming like from heaven, like an angel coming from heaven. Here she's going to be like a, an angel. I think that the hair is very light, very blonde, could be white, uh, could be a mix, or they could have turned it very, very blonde or very light blonde. And I think that many of you, you're Plegidian, so you're working with Plegidians. And Nocturians, I am missing as well, Andromedan as well. So, does it make sense? <laughs> when we connect with that great energy, 
we attract incredible stuff. So practice. Make people change their vibration. Don't worry what they think about. I mean, if they're going to get in defense, it's their problem, not yours. But you, I think that you are very intelligent and you know who, who with what, with who you, sorry, with, uh, no, focus, with what people you, with, oh my gosh, with what type of people you can be like that. Right? I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I have, I have just done a live on, on Instagram in the Spanish account and I have been healing. I think that's why I'm like this. Okay, let's go with the, um, don't worry about the virus. Okay, my lovelies. Okay. No, I'm going to shuffle more. Let's see what spirits could tell us more. But I think that if you're going to start just being relaxed and look, the star. Oh my gosh, the star is coming out again. This is celebration, pure love, true love, success, 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 written in the stars, fate, destiny. Oh my gosh, Aquarius. We are in the Aquarius area season. So come on, shine your light shine your light and suddenly fireworks outside celebration pure love true love this is going to be like a like a movie from bollywood or hollywood come on my love you just need to be like you are because you are a loving person i'm gonna tell you i know that they hurt you in the past don't stop dimming your light stop dimming Sorry, my loves. Stop dimming your light because somebody heard you or because your mom is not treating you right or your dad or an ex or some friends. You are a natural healer. I'm going to tell you, you're a natural healer coming from heaven. I think that in a past life you have been an angel, but you chose to reincarnate as a human being and your man or your woman as well. Fireworks at the same time. It's not a coincidence. You are meant to have an incredible, successful love, pure, true, like a movie love story. You just need to start, start to have gestures. It's easy for you. Come on, guys. I know it's easy for you. If you, if I sense that with other type of people, I would know it, it would be more difficult for another person, but I know it's easy for you because you have a great heart. You are very lovable. You are very loving, but in a, in a point in your life in the past, you close yourself because they hurt you. I understand it. We understand it. And just understand it. But right now you need to flow. And in order to flow, you need to practice with people, co-workers, a stranger. Maybe you're going to, to go to buy the baguette to the, the bread and you tell her or him, oh, whatever. Something funny is, and you change their day. Really? You are incredible at changing the energy of people. You see it in me, right? I suppose. I hope <laughs> I see it in you. Okay, my love, my sunshine. Okay, let's see about the... Wow. I'm so happy for all of you guys. It's going to be easier than what you think. Let's see with the Oracle of the Unicorn. Expansion. Does it make sense? Spread your wings and soar. Share your message and shine your light. Show the world what you're made of. What were spirits telling you? That's why I love to shuffle in front of you. Because I want you to trust. Come on, expand. Don't close your energy, your energetical field. Expand, have joy, have fun, dance, sing. Be nice with somebody, with a stranger, with a coworker. Be nice with people. Don't, don't worry if they are mean or not, if they're going to refuse you or not. It's not that they're going to refuse you or reject you. No, you are doing this from your loving and conditional loving energy. And some people, if they don't know how to get to a to really it's going to impact everyone i'm not telling you i mean i understand maybe you needed a process but a per day choose somebody that you're going to do something nice okay my angel expand yourself expand your wings expand your love it's time to open open the, the heart chakra don't close it anymore it's the moment to expand yourself Okay, my sunshines, I want you to think about a question. I'm going to answer you with this tarot. I love you. <laughs> wow, today is an incredible day, isn't it? Oh my gosh. And you're incredible. You are incredible. And you're going to make it. Don't worry, here she's coming. 
listen to intuition has come out in, in the other group as well you are very intuitive you know what's good or not you know what's the truth or not people cannot lie to you you know how to vibrate from your loving energy you know how to expand you know how to manifest this incredible love story you just need to open your heart chakra so i recommend you guided meditations for your heart chakra color green maybe you should be wearing a stone that it's green greenish or maybe you should wear a little bit of green don't work so much dark some of you don't wear dark work light colors and smile practice smiling pra really guys i tell you I, I hope you listen to me because i am very psychic if per day you do something a nice gesture to anyone that you choose a joke a smile you help somebody you leave some you allow somebody to to sit in your in your seat whatever you are going to manifest this person in less than three months in less than one month in just a few days some of you okay okay my love is i'm getting excited i love you thank you for the donations if you want to purchase one of my personal symbols if you want to know about a past life this is a new service i'm going to write it everything in my description i love you you're the best come on open your heart chakra come on you're a natural healer i love you and you have been an angel come on my brothers my sisters i love you Mwah. bye my sweeties bye